All right, try giving this another shot. So I decided that my hideout slash home for my whatever, two or three days I decide to stay in Moncton, if I do decide to stay another day, uh, well, we'll say two, was Gunningsville Bridge. Uh, it's a huge bridge. And I checked the other side out underneath too, but I didn't really feel that uh, it looked as secure or safe. So I trekked over to this side, and funny enough, I'm in Riverview. So, today alone, I have gone through a city, into another city. Well, first of all, I left the city, or a town, into a city, through a city, into another city, back through another city, back into the town. So, you know, even though I haven't actually gone anywhere, I feel very accomplished today. Um, so, there's the bridge. I'll show you where I decide to stash up my stuff. I'm hoping that no one found it and stole it. Although I guess you can't take something that, you know, I don't know. I don't think anything of mine has my name on it. <laughs> All right. So here's our underpass. All right. Doesn't look super cozy, does it? Uh, but. I try to be a little bit more inventive. So, I stuck that little rock pile there. And I decide to stay up here. All right. So we're gonna see how fast I can get up there because I don't really want to stop the video. I'll show you what I've done. Let's hope my stuff's still hidden up there somewhere. All right, I don't know how easy it is to see right now. But, so here we are. All right. Oh shit, where's my stuff? Fuck. Shit. Oh, oh I think I see it hidden right up there. Uh, very dark, but if you were where I am, you can see that there was these like poles kind of put through here and had enough space that I actually shoved my backpack up on top. Uh, and I couldn't see it from down there. I'm pretty sure none of you guys did, so it obviously worked out really well for me. Um, just cleared out this spot and once I get all my stuff laid out, it's actually a really nice spot. Got decent views of the Bay of Fundy. And I'm pretty sure it was late last night that I heard the tidal bore actually come in. Uh, so I thought that was kind of cool. But, uh, you know, completely protected from the rain in here. And uh, I'm up off the ground, so no one's going to surprise me, uh, which makes me feel extra safe in this specific location. Um, I guess that's it. Maybe after I get everything set up and my bag down and whatnot, I'll give you a quick little picture of uh, you know, how it looks when I'm, I'm here. So I uh, hope you guys like the videos. Much love.